How's it going, guys? My name is the Hoodman Brandon. Give me a sec. My camera's still acting a little weird. Well, I'll I'll start this up and up while this is going. Um, welcome back to Metal Gear Rising: Revengeance. Uh, last time we zoomed in to see a factory that had some interesting stuff, believe it or not. And now, and there was some type of a woman coming that was causing us something. Cause a stir at right in, and now we're going to go break into this thing and see what's up, because that's what we should do. Also, executing everyone, because that is what Raiden is best at. Anyway, uh, yes, I am good. Thank you very much. Execute. Ah, okay. Um, I'm not good at stealth type things, but somehow I'm doing really good at this type of thing. Seriously, I, I have no idea how I'm doing this good without my, uh, thing that I use for stealth. ba da ba ba ba, -ba! Stealth kill! Uh, I don't know if that bought me some time or that slowed me down, but I just seriously just stealth killed everything. Let's see, there's a couple items over here. I might as well go get them while I have a chance to. I mean, they're here. Let's see, grab this. Electromagnetic grenade. That could come in handy if I ever need to save some hostages. Uh, a regular grenade. That could be useful if I get bored. Grenades I just use when I'm bored, or honestly. Oh. There's another thing up there. Let's see. Yeah. I don't, I've actually never opened this before. Plus 5,000 points. I can dig it. Because I'm going to need to buy, like, a ton of upgrades in the future. I haven't bought any upgrades, actually, yet. Um, I could, like, in between sessions of this game. But, uh... I feel like it's kind of... Just We've accepted call for backup during your last fight. The caller's position is on your solid on radio. Okay. You can engage if you wish. Is it your choice? Okay. This happens sometimes. Um, there's a new thing at the fight, basically. Um, it could be an army. It could be almost nothing. Um, if I miss it, though, I can skip a whole battle sequence. But I could ignore it. And it's, but it would lower my grade in the overall grade of this game. I'm going to go ahead and fight these things just because I want to. Anyway, they're helicopters. I have two missiles. Alright, now I can just slice this thing. And you're down. And goodbye. Yeah, so basically, there's these mid battle sequences. They're not that hard to do sometimes, or sometimes they're really annoying to do. Anyway, the best the thing about these things is they affect your overall grade in the level. Which is at the end of the... Well, you've seen how long these stages can be. They can be anywhere from a couple minutes to, well, an uh, hour. Give or take. Um, skipping cutscenes usually is a fast way of finishing this off. But, uh... Overall, it's kind of difficult to, to save. Anyway... The cliff is just ahead at the end of the old city. Beyond that... So what? It's a sheer drop? The refinery's not connected to the city at all? No. It was only built two years ago. There should be a narrow path around there that leads to the plant. It is protected by a fence, but probably you can cut your way through. Yeah. Don't get cocky. Most likely it is Desperado running security down there. 
Alright, here we go. So, basically, now we're breaking into the factory. And there are some little new robots that are really, they're in, more or less annoying to fight. I mean, I can defeat them, like, easily, but that's about it. Basically, they can grab onto you, and if you, you throw them. But actually, when they die, they drop healing things. If you kill them naturally. And it's kind of helpful. They're more helpful than anything else. Anyway, this guy's just here for being for, for sakes, and I just get a, get a spine. That's how it is. And you're dead. I'm not even worried that I didn't grab a spine because I'll just kill these things and get more or, or what I need more health and more energy so I can chop them. I'm sorry my conversation isn't really that interesting, but I've not really had much to talk about. I mean, Metal Gear is Metal Gear, that's all I can say. I actually, actually, make most, I just realized that most games I'm playing have had something to do with Square Enix. I mean, minus Five Nights at Freddy's, of course. Wait, there's a door? Oh no, I, I saw something. Oh no, it was just that. Never mind. I thought that was a door. I don't know, anyway, I was about to be surprised. But what you can do is go in here. Now, these cameras, whenever they get you, it alerts everyone. But they're not hard to destroy. And as long as you stay... And it's the classic thing, just stay out of their light and you're fine. So, by doing so... Also, you just, sometimes you can destroy the pillar they're on, which instantly destroys it. That is also a good thing to do. Huh. Alright, now here, you gotta look, because there's lasers. Alright, see, now you can see, basically that whole thing I'm doing, being with the mask, it's so I can see what's happening. Like, see, now I know that's there, and now I can see that it's dead. There are a ton of lasers here. So, I'm going to ignore some of these cameras because they're kind of just in the way. Oh, shoot. Don't notice me. Do not notice me, Senpai. Haha. <laughs> Die. Do not let that camera catch me. Yes. Alright, that's one less camera. And several more enemies. Oh shoot, 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 run. Run, 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 run. You will not notice me. So this is mostly a stealth game, I guess. Even though I don't really like think of it as one. No one's here. Astra. <laughs> oh, he had a left arm. Sweet. This is one of those rare guys that have a left arm that is necessary. Okay. Whoa. Ooh. Killing everybody because I can! The spine belongs to me! And good. Ignore the cameras because they're not necessary. Okay. Now I just gotta wait down here for the cameras to calm to cool down and oh, see? Gone. Now I can now I can just easily make my way through as soon as I find my There we go. Now we're actually about to enter a boss, but since since I am me, of course, and of course I do not have time, I'm gonna have to leave this episode with me grabbing this data right here. Here. Next time on Metal Gear Rising Revengeance, we will continue on and have an epic boss fight with 
if an enemy cyborg. Like and favorite if you enjoyed. Subscribe so I can have some more of that my good old YouTube love. Anyway, um, hey, the, hey, if I check my Twitter for any further announcements or special, not my, probably I don't really go there that much because most announcements I make are all be on YouTube. Anyway, hey, thank you, thank you for enjoying this video, and I will see all you in the next video.